Hi, this is Kamil here and uh, today I'd like to tell you about how to use actually a pendulum. Now, um, the theory is that your subconscious mind knows everything that there is to know or at least it knows everything to what you have been exposed to in all your life. And what you want to do is to learn to talk to your subconscious mind. So you need to establish a communication channel and one of the easiest way is to use a pendulum. A pendulum can be anything, it can be something like this, it can be a needle on a thread, or your wedding ring, doesn't matter. Uh, so what do you need to do first? First you need to allow yourself to transfer the signals, micro tensions in your muscles, to the hand so it moves. You start like this, you need to find a comfortable position, it can be sitting, standing, you need to find out whether you want to hold your pendulum like this or maybe like that, whether to make it short or long, it's up to you, you will need to experiment to find the best option. Uh, what you do then, you think of a move, for example, a move like that, circular move. So you first do it consciously and you think, okay, I want to cause pendulum to move like this and you do it consciously. The next thing you do, you say, okay, now my subconscious mind, please move this uh, pendulum like this in the same way. And what is going to happen? Your subconscious mind will start causing micro tensions in your hand, which will cause your hand to move like this. But at first, you will actually block those moves because that, that's unnatural for you. You will feel like, what's happening? No, I, my hand is shaking. No, I do not want that. So it will take you, I don't know, maybe three days of practicing, 10 minutes a day. You will learn in those three days to actually allow those micro tensions to actually move your hand and move the pendulum. Once you've done it, uh, then you need to establish a code with your subconscious mind. So you might want to say, okay, I want this movement to mean yes, and I want this movement to mean no, or this movement to mean yes, and this movement to mean no, or this movement to mean mm, not so much, and this movement to mean maybe, but I do not recommend it, or anything that you want. First start with yes and no, to make it simple. Or you can simply ask your subconscious mind, what's the signal for yes? And your subconscious mind will move the, your hand to move the pendulum in a given way. It's very easy, anybody can do it, it's a matter of time. So once again, you are trying to establish a communication channel with your subconscious mind using micro tensions, micro moves of your muscles to move the pendulum. And you need to learn to allow that to happen. That's it. So go and practice and let me know how you're doing. Cheers.